What what terrifies you the most, an eternal universe or a finite universe? Yeah, they're both incomprehensible. The the eternal universe, the, if there was an eternal universe, does that negate the theory of the Big Bang, or does it mean that there's a constant cycle of Big Bangs and then expansion and then recompression? Or Yeah, it could do. So those theories are back in vogue. Some of those theories are back in vogue again. So yes, some of them say that there's a, a cycling universe. Um, so the Big Bang is an event when space gets very hot and very dense and filled with particles. And that may happen again. Or some of the other theories, uh, there's a theory called eternal inflation, which is a theory that, and it's actually the most popular theory, I think, at the moment, for what happened, for why the Big Bang is the way that it is. Because it's got some very special features, the Big Bang, which we could talk about. But inflation is the idea that space, space time was around before the Big Bang, and it was expanding extremely fast. And it was doubling in size in the most popular of these theories every 10 to the minus 37 seconds, which is point naught, 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 with 37 noughts, one of a second. So it's an unimaginably fast expansion.